Okay guys, so I'm back and I wanted to try this trend that I keep seeing people do and they've been using like an like a a glow serum or glow um primer. I'm going to use the Elf primer, glow primer, and I'm in the shade what shade is this? Uh I don't know what shade this is. I guess it's the label comes off. I'm in the deeper shades, of course. And I'm going to use a powder on top so you kind of get like a glow without being oily so i'm just gonna use this i wish i had gotten like a um what you gonna call it a lighter shade as well to do um highlighting with but i like this too i'm using a lot probably don't need that much and then I'm going to go over it with some powder. So let's do this real quick. I like using this because it gives good coverage. So, but it gives a nice glow. It, I think you everybody has seen this trend with the L'Oreal powder and the L'Oreal glow. So, but I wanted to try it for myself. But I had the e.l.f. stuff, so I said, let me just use the e.l.f. stuff to try the trend with. So, and I like it because I'm oily and see, now we're good. I could stop right now and just go about my day, but I'm not going to. Okay, so now we're going to just go. I'm going to use the e.l.f. powder. I love this camo powder. And I'm in the shade 620 Rich. That's the shade that I'm in in the, um, the liquid version as well. And I'm just going to use my powder um, brush, which is Jaclyn Hill. If you guys don't know about Jaclyn Hill brushes, they're really good for Morphe. Very good. So let's just get this together. There'll be probably a part two. And let's see what this looks like. I'm trying to see if I still have a glow. It looks good. Okay, so this is what we're looking like for the trend. Um, I do see a little bit of a glow. Um, you see kind of like in my T-zone area. But I think I needed to get like a lighter shade of this e.l.f. halo glow. Um, I do really like it, but I just probably needed like a lighter shade to give me that really um, ex accentuated glow that I'm looking for. But I still think this looks really good with the powder on top. So let me finish my face and I'll be right back. Okay, here we are with the finished look. I didn't do anything too extravagant, um, but I like the way it looks because I am bright, but like look at the brightness that I'm getting. I did put some highlighter on. I did put this highlighter on. I love this highlighter. It's in 24 karat gold. It's like the, more of a like inner inner glow instead of like a bright stark highlighter. I love this, especially on my skin complexion. So I would pick this up if you're my complexion. Very nice highlighter because it's not too overly bearing. Love it. But the I'm, I like I like one of my results, but I think what I'm gonna do next time is I'm gonna get like a lighter halo glow. I'm gonna get a, a lighter version of this and try it again. So anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one. Make sure to thumbs up the video, like the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.